What's going on there, everybody, and welcome back to some more trucking with Eye Vision. We are here in Wichita City. Not. We are in Wichita, though. Uh, so, yeah, here we are, and uh, we are at the Antonov's place. We're going up to Selena today with a load of cargo. We're going to go check out the uh, dealership up here, and then we'll finish it off. We're going to Spirit. So we're taking from the uh, wonderful Antonov over here. Well, this bad boy. We got ourselves some engine uh, cowls here. So it's a little bit of a wide load for us. And uh, yeah, we don't have any lights, but you know, whatever. We're just, it's a little bit of a gray area for the moment. You know, not official regulations. But yeah, so we didn't get to actually go inside the plane, which I would have liked to go inside, but whatever. It's fine. The, the load's just sitting out right here for us. So it is a, what it is. Look at how cool that plane is, though. Oh, man, she's a beauty. Ultimus Air Cargo, though, is, uh, is what she is. But yeah, so we're going to get going. Like I said, we're in Wichita. We're going to head up to Salina. It should be a short run for us. 135 miles is our trip time or our trip length. Not really our time, right? Miles is not a time distance. Uh, so yeah, that's what we got going on. And then we will, uh, yeah, I don't know what we're going to do after after we get to Salina. It's, the state hasn't gone at all like I've wanted. I really have wanted to do a totally different loop than I have, and we've just been kind of mishmash making this work. Uh, it's not been it's not been perfect, but it is it is what it is. So uh, we're gonna really have to keep uh, keep our center here to us today, because like I said we are wide. Are you gonna let's go? I'm confused. All right. Thank you. Whoa. Uh, hello. Unreal. Unreal, these people. Like, I can't do 0 to 60 in 30 seconds. Alright, so just hang on. Um, I thought that guy was going to go, to be honest. But man, this this weight, she's, she's pretty hefty back there. That almost looks like road debris. That did look like road debris. Interesting. Um, yeah, I don't know. So, 11,000 pounds. I guess it's not even that even heavy. It feels heavier than what she is, um, but whatever. Yeah, we just, it's going to be a very, it's almost going to be a little bit slow going for me because I'm going to be really concerned about whacking somebody. We get the benefit though of, right, of it being AI, so they're going to do, they're going to do what they're going to do and I'm going to do what I'm going to do. And luckily, we are always going to win here in this instance. So, yeah, let's see how this goes here, but yeah, we're good. We've got the green light there. Beautiful. And we're on to the main interstate now. So we're going to be on the interstate for the whole trip. Part of it, like we said, we've seen already because we've come through into Wichita. But yeah, I just I was I just really wanted to get us on the road and, and trucking. Like that's that's just what we need to do. Just get on the road and truck. Um, so we're gonna be going up north. So let's I think we're gonna stay in this lane here. Let's just make sure. Okay, it looks like middle lane maybe. So we're gonna get over one lane. Hopefully the the signs aren't wrong. Could you imagine though if the signs are wrong, that would not be good. So yeah, we're gonna go to Selena. So whoa, what's uh what's going on here? Oh, and we can't even go this way. We got it all closed. Unreal. This this would be our luck. Honestly. This would be our luck. Sorry, Joe. Man, seriously, come on, dude. You gotta slow down for that curve. Yeah, gotta slow down for the curve. That's fine. So we're gonna go up here and around. At least this isn't a, a super long uh, detour. Um, which is good. All right, I've complained about that many times. About like if you're gonna have the detour, it's fine, right? Like it, it's, it's normal. But back early on, like the detours felt like they were like forever. It just like they really brought you out of your way. And it's just we don't we don't need that. We we really don't need that. We just need to 
get on and get trucking and just having a good old time, right? That's all we need. That's all that's all I'm asking for is a good old time. Oh man. So I've been trying this new thing. <laughs> it was kind of weird. I was listening to somebody talk. And they were talking about when they speak, they try to move their mouth, like overexert their mouth movements. Uh, Cause it, it talked about like, you know, the more you exert your mouth into the speech, at least for an American, the, the easier you are to understand. Cause I guess we use our mouths a lot. So I've been trying it. I don't know if I noticed the difference yet, but it's, uh, it's interesting, I guess. I mean, it makes sense on the concept, but a very interesting one indeed. But yeah, so we are going to go and just, yeah, just gonna roll with things. Uh, if you haven't seen things lately on the channel, things are moving along. Uh, we've kind of been doing emergency. I've kind of like, that one kind of goes up in spurts for me. It's like, we do it, then we kind of back off, then we do it. Uh, I think I'm going to go back to backing off again for that one. And uh, maybe do that one like every other week. It might be more of what that one turns into instead of a weekly one right now. There just isn't enough content, in my opinion, to do every week. Uh, and the numbers, I, I got to look back through the numbers, but I don't think the numbers show that a weekly one is necessary. At times it does, though. Like, I feel like if you look at the last four, like two out of the four are good, right? Like. That's what makes me think like in every other would be okay. But I don't, I don't know. I got to look back through that stuff and kind of make a decision. And I got to make a decision very quickly uh, on that. Uh, and then we still got Two Point Campus going, which I know doesn't really get viewed that much. I don't care. I'm still playing that game because I want to play it. So that means you're going to get a series for it. Uh, I could go back and not do a series, but I feel like at this point we're already so deep into it. You just got to roll with it. Uh, and then now our new thing on Saturdays is a seal rama at least for now. I'm going to kind of play that one by ear as well, because there's just not as much content there, in my opinion, that makes that one a very worthy series, I guess. Like there's a point, but it's like, yeah, we're just going and shipping stuff, but we'll, we'll see. We'll do a few episodes, see how it kind of goes, and then kind of reevaluate that one. And then obviously we got American Truck Simulator on Sundays currently. So I think we, after this city, we're gonna have, I believe it's five or six more. I'm trying to think. I think it's, it might be six. I think it's six. Uh, so yeah, we'll we'll see afterwards, but I'm pretty sure it's six. So that means we still got a little ways to go here. New content will most likely be coming, right? Because at that point, we're already in February. So we're talking probably late March. That by the time we kind of knock things out, maybe beginning of April there, which means the next state will be coming. Oh my God, I didn't realize how fast we were going. Look how fast we were cruising. We're doing 70, we're doing 89 there. I was just talking and cruising. I had no idea. This obviously is not a World of Trucks contract. Because uh, if it was, we would not be getting that high. We'd only be doing 65. But yeah, that's. Uh, I was just, I was just driving, just, you know, minding my own business, having a good time, just cruising. I mean, the load was was doing good. There's, I had no concerns with the load. I mean, she looks great. I mean, I just love it. Just the loads are looking so good, and that's that's all I care about, right? But. Good loads and good times. So we're coming up though. We, we, I mean, we literally are almost to our, I wouldn't say almost, we're 63, 61 miles away. It's, uh, when we're doing these speeds, it goes by really, really quick. But I mean, that's been the whole case. This, it's been the, it's been the case this whole series. Wow. Uh, it's a just broken, broken English there. But yeah, so that's been the, been the case the whole series where at least we're going through Kansas. The city distance is very short, so we're just like literally knocking these out in a very short time. Um, but yeah, it's good and bad, I guess. But we are coming up into Selena here, as you can kind of see on the GPS. So city limit, 
and we should be getting it seen there. There it is. Selena's now been discovered. So, okay. And looking at it, uh, we do have seven cities, not six. So there are seven cities left to uh, to check out. So I'll show you that on the map after uh, after we get this dropped off. But let's. Uh, we got some stuff to go check out for now. And I'm trying to think of. I want to be in the left lane. So we'll just kind of get over there. I do need to swap out this truck, though. We've had this truck for quite a while. I'm sure you guys are ready for something different. So I don't know what we're going to do there. Normally, I kind of get, get, get in a truck and drive it for the for the whole state. But we did swap it, and now I I, I do want to swap it out. But we're going we're going to be at another Western Star dealership. It's like, ah, we don't need another Western Star. We've already got one. So I don't know what I'm gonna do there, but we'll uh, we'll figure something out here. We do have a nice little photo opportunity coming up shortly here, so that's gonna be awesome. We got ourselves a Denny's uh, in our tried and true Walmart over there. We got a uh, Amazon warehouse right there too. Oh wow, that's cool. But man, yeah, this load looks good. She's looking real, real good here. Yeah, so. Uh, other than that, I mean, that is, I mean, we, we talked about, covered a lot there in a very short amount of time, but yeah, that is literally like everything that's kind of going on right now, but you know, yeah, uh, you know, good times and, and, and whatnot. I don't know what I'm like expecting though, later on this year, I, I do want to still go back to Alaskan road, tr uh, truckers. At some point, I hope we can get back there. If if that game kind of gets into a good spot, uh, I mean, they say they're working on it and really focused on bug fixes and whatnot. I I, I just I don't know how they can be though. I, I mean, before I started this recording, I looked at the numbers, and this is weekend numbers. I'll tell you right now, like, uh, on a weekend, 58 is what the number was currently playing when I when I checked and I'm like that's just not sustainable for a game developer uh in my opinion unless it's a side project right if it's a side project 100 percent uh but I don't think that game was designed to be a side project like I think it was designed that it would be a a main competitor to American Truck Simulator and uh ETS2 so I don't know but here we are, we got ourselves a good old uh, photo opportunity coming up here. So we're going to get our truck in the right position. Oh, look at that little pedestrian crosswalk lights. How oh, cool. This is the, the photo opportunity building right here. So we're going to get on the other side of the, uh, the light here and then we'll check it out. I don't even know what this is. What is that? It's very interesting, whatever it is. It's a building. It's a big one. It's almost like a courthouse or something. It's a courthouse of courts. What else do we got over here? Anything good? And these cars get really close to you. Hello, buddy. You're in my uh, you're in my space. But yeah, that's uh, that's what we got. So we're gonna pull up here and uh, then we'll go and get our photo that we can use. Then we can move on. Look at this thing. This thing is amazing. Whatever it is. But we will be right back. All right, so that there was the Masonic Temple. Yes, that's what that is. Masonic Temple. Not really sure what that is, but apparently it's very important or very recognized in the city of Selena. Look at this. Uh, we get to go first, and then you come. Like, why does the AI do that? Yeah, that's something. That is something. At least they recognize us. So before it gets too crazy. Oh boy. Ooh, that got close. I mean, we could have been a little bit closer, but man, that was ooh, dangerous. Dangerous. Look at this thing. That's cool. That's really cool. It's like a. I don't know what it is. We're in the pedestrian crosswalk. We should not have stopped here. Should not have stopped here. I wonder if the AI stops in front of it. I would assume they do. But. Yeah. 
Normally you shouldn't. Uh, there is a theater right there as well. So that is very nice. A lot of neat little shops downtown here. So be a little nice area to go if you're visiting or something. Looks like a good spot. Oh, we're running it. We're running it. But look at this thing. That is so cool. That is really cool. Oh, interesting. That is definitely different, but that was super cool. That is super, super cool. Did not know they, uh, they had stuff like that. I didn't even know that they could generate that type of stuff. So that is, that's new. Oh, Mr. Fire Truck there. Did you, uh, did you know what you were doing? I don't know if he did. He goes, he was whipping it around that curve. Whipping it around that turn. All right. We're almost, uh, you know, I'd say almost there. 39 miles. But essentially, we got to go up to the truck dealership, and then we're going to swing back down. But our return trip will be on the highway more than anything. So we'll be, we'll be pretty good there. All right, come on, make your turn. Let's go make your turn so I can make mine. Yep, yep. Very nice. It's nice that you can like whip these trucks around, around curves. It's just don't like straighten it out too quickly. <laughs> or it's kind of like, um, I guess you almost kind of have to a little bit. I don't know. All right, we do need to get over. That might have been my mistake there. I thought that car was turning, to be honest. Let's uh, swiddle over here like so. And uh, what do you got there? Have a slice of Domino's pizza. Yeah. Uh, if we're taking up two lanes, it's fine. We're just going up to the... Um, we're actually going to pass it. We could probably cut in the gas station there, to be honest. Uh, depending. It'd be easier probably than turning around in the uh, in the dealership parking lot. Like, the dealership parking lot is nice, right? Like, it's a decent size. Definitely still tough, though, if you got a trailer back there. Oh, and this guy. Are you freaking kidding me? Unreal, bro. Did you not see me? Unreal. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? We just gotta do us. All right, so here we are coming up. We got the, like I said, the Western Star truck dealership. Hopefully we don't actually have to go in, but I think we're gonna have to go down the street. So whatever, it's fine. We'll do it. There's the Popo. All right, so Western Star has been found. Actually, we could probably, oh, this is perfect. You can just turn around in here. This actually works out really well. Uh, hopefully there's an exit though up here. I think there is. Yeah, there is. So this works out perfectly. Then we'll just kind of come out here and then we'll hop back on. So that works. I actually think we could have went left too. Maybe, no, that's part of the Western Star dealership. Uh, but yeah, it's good. good call. All right. I think he's turning left, right? Maybe not. Maybe he's going straight. Sorry if I took your opportunity. I definitely did. Because he was going straight, I think. He still could have put his directional on. For whatever reason, he didn't. Or I didn't see it. Sometimes I miss him. You know, because the just the way that the waiting is. Sometimes you just miss those things. But whatever. All right, let's get this finished. 32 miles. Uh, I would expect that our uh, customer expects delivery soon to to start coming. I actually don't know when it's actually required to be there. Let's uh, let's see. It's required by 5:39. So actually, oh, we got a decent amount of time yet. We're actually making good time. Yeah, we got plenty of time here. All right, we uh, want to slow her down. We don't want to be like that one truck and have a rollover on the uh, on the curve. Ooh, that was 
Oh, that's bad. That's bad. Almost, you know, a couple times it's been a little shaky even like in my car. Been hit, hit a couple a little too fast. And I go, oh boy. All right, just let me over, boy. <laughs> See, that's how you got to do that. You just kind of got to be like, mm, you're going to let me over whether you want to or not. Because I'm further ahead than you are. Uh, in real life, eh, yeah, probably can't get away with that. I mean, you could try. <laughs> Definitely could try. The odds are not in your favor, though. Most of the time. But for this, eh, we made it work. But yeah, see, now that we're, we're getting outside the city there, we're kind of going around it. Oh, uh, yeah, we are We're doing fine. We're doing, making up some great good time here. So, because we're already down to eight miles. So, down to six, and then we're going to get off here and bring this into a spirit area of nauticals. That is where we are going. So, kind of another part of that plane theme that we've been kind of on lately which is crazy um, on the timing I've seen just before this recording uh, two helicopter crashes and a small plane crash uh, not I haven't like physically seen them uh, but read about them all in the same week here uh, before doing this recording so it's super crazy about that stuff uh, but yeah, let's, uh, what is this over here, too? I feel like that's a recruit agency. That might be a viewpoint, though. So we might actually get a viewpoint here in uh, Selena, which is actually kind of nice. I don't know how I missed that before. Or maybe I saw it and was like, oh, yeah, we're going right there, so it's fine. Don't need to, don't need to call that one out specifically, but, you know, maybe I did need to. Who knows? But we're almost there. If this guy can kind of, we got to merge left. Is this a merge lane? Or, yep, it is. Interesting. Oh, okay. Thank you for uh, letting me over, I guess. So, all right, let's see what we got here. It's on the right hand side. That's fine. No, that's a recruit agency. Yeah, definitely is. Yep. Recruitment agency. So, not a viewpoint. Oh, boy. What happened here? What happened over here? That's a shame. That would have been cool if there was a, was a viewpoint, but I get it. I get it. All right, take it nice and wide as we could. And then, uh, yeah, so we're going back here. Looks like a storm's moving in. Looks like a storm is moving into Kansas. Right, because I'm, I'm all turned around now. I'm pretty sure that's coming from the west, though. But let's see. Oh, we got a tower over here. So that means there is a runway. Oh, there's a plane over here. Look at that. It looks like an old one, though. Maybe? Oh, yeah. It's definitely an older one. That's cool. Different. Uh, we're going to try and go. I think we'll be fine. Yeah. Is that the truck we were uh, following before? It might be. Yes. I know. We're good. All right. Let's get away from that gate there. So this is uh, this is where they want her. We don't really get to go in very far, apparently. That kind of stinks. I was kind of hoping we can get a little bit further in and kind of really see some things, but apparently not. Which is fine. It is what it is. It's not our call. But we can kind of hop out here. Oh, look at that. Bunch of planes in the hangar there. That one's under wraps. Interesting. Very cool. I was expecting to see much bigger planes, though. I mean, I don't think these covers are going to fit on any of these these types of engines. But maybe maybe that one back there. I don't know, though. But yeah, so we did it. We got into Selena. Like I said, we have seven more cities to go. Uh, so we'll have to kind of make our way. Phillipsburg is being a pain. It really is. So hopefully we can figure something out there, but yeah, yeah, this is what we got left. So lots to do yet. And uh, yeah, like always, it's always a blast. It's always fun. I hope you guys enjoyed it as well as we made our way from Wichita to Selena. But that's going to do it for me. Thanks a lot for watching, everybody. And I hope to catch you all next time with some more trucking with iVision. Trucking with iVision.